Helping on short notice is apparently not a problem for the American Red Cross. The organization putting on a blood drive February 28th with just two days to prepare. Here's IWTV student Nathan Connolly. The American Red Cross has planned many blood drives in the past. This one, though, is slightly different. Council Bluffs Library allowed us to um, set up in their, their meeting room and we were able to put together a blood drive in less than two days. A variety of people attend the event. Robert Burns, a fellow patriot, says this is just one way to make an impact. It can help save my fellow countrymen's lives, you know. If somebody needs my blood, fine. I'd rather help them than before myself anyways. It's that kind of act that inspires Kathy Haldeman to give blood. Well, you know, if I ever had the need or someone in my family had the need for it, I would hope that there would be blood available um, to help us. According to the American Red Cross, less than 38% of the U.S. population is eligible to give blood. Haldeman says she'll continue to help as long as she's capable. Um, so as long as I'm healthy and able, I want to give. And the opportunity to do so is regularly available. We actually have a blood drive at Iowa Western on March 13th. Uh, we also have um, our chapter site at, at the American Red Cross chapter site on 16th and G. We have a blood drive every Monday and Tuesday. The blood drive at Iowa Western will run from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. The American Red Cross will also be at Abraham Lincoln High School on March 22nd. For your Council Bluffs News, I'm Nathan Connolly.